so uh, class today we will do that work done in adiabatic expansion in the last video last class we have done the work done in isothermal expansion isothermal expansion that means the boundary wall should be conductive got it but in this adiabatic that means there is no heat transfer so q will be zero and if we will draw the system the system will be like how the system is like this here the gas is that and the piston is kept over there yes and now this wall will be completely insulated isn't it that means the heat shouldn't uh, transfer from the system to surrounding not uh, surrounding to system so this should be perfectly or you say they absolutely insulated yes absolutely insulated hona chahiye any doubt in this okay so uh, we will learn the same way in that uh, we have done for the isothermal so before that i just want to tell you that for the isothermal we have done for uh, let me write over here for isothermal what we have written that equation boyle's law is there that means p1 v1 is equal to p2 v2 isn't it this is for isothermal expansion boyle's law but uh, uh, for this adiabatic law similar same uh, like as it is same it also have a like formula but it is little different and that is called poisson's equation okay so for adiabatic uh, for adiabatic there is an expansion or adiabatic uh, yeah, equation there is that uh, work we instead of this p1 v1 it is p1 v1 gamma is equal to p2 v2 gamma and this is called poisson's law for adiabatic okay poisson's equation or that it is poisson's sorry it's o n poisson's equation okay got it so in this gamma what is this gamma gamma is actually uh, cp upon cb now you will ask that what is the cp and cb so don't worry about that we will do that heat capacity at constant pressure and heat capacity at constant volume so we will do it in a uh, future lecture okay so by the time you have to keep in mind this gives the atomicity it gives atomicity of the gas like the gas can be monoatomic can be diatomic can be triatomic if it is monoatomic like uh, we can say helium neon yes it always exists as a monoatomic for this the gamma value is gamma value is 1.66 for diatomic diatomic this gamma value is 1.4 and for triatomic triatomic the gamma value is 1.33 so that thing this thing you have to learn okay this thing you have to learn atomicity where uh where, where. we don't have to uh, know this all this thing so since it came though that's why i have explained but we have to use this poisson's equation for finding the work done in adiabatic exp expansion so how it is let's uh, start so similarly we will do we will put as a isothermal we have done we will put some weight over here yes and that weight is literally very small very very small got it so at this time why we keep you know, this small object over there or small mass over there to put it in equilibrium okay so that the p external this is p gas and this is p external that should be same okay so for that i like the it is frictionless piston so that will move from up to down and down to up like this expansion and contraction will be there because it is frictionless so what i will do i will exactly first we will achieve the equilibrium equilibrium kehne ka matlab that the p external will be equal to p uh, internal p gas okay so now there no, there is no, like neither there is a expansion nor contraction the volume ghat raha hai na volume bad raha hai okay but if you will take out the small part over here chhota sa part agar hum hatate hain so obviously dp will be decrease and uh, p gas jo gaya wo zyada ho gaya expansion will be there like this got it so as we have done the isothermal part so here also let me do uh, the same formula we will use that w is equal to minus p external and delta v where from this we will start with this um, v i and v final the limit will be like that okay so in this case 
reversible uh, adiabatic we are doing okay so uh, adiabatic expansion we are doing reversible adiabatic expansion okay so in this case what it will be like this is p external again i am assuming that p external is equal to p gas okay there is no problem as we have done in the isothermal if uh, i hope you people can uh, uh, recall this yes so now this is since let me because dp is very small okay so very small so that's why we can say that p external is equal to p gas and if it is so we have a formula pv is equal to nrt yes or this is p gas we can write so can we say that p is equal to p is equal to nrt upon v and that is a nrt is a constant yes so constant upon v can i write is there any problem in this okay so now <clears throat> just be careful over here this is how we got this p1 v1 that means it is a constant so can i write instead of this v can i write v gamma because we have to use this one isn't it so can i write like this got it samajh me aagi baat so now this is ab put the value in this so w will be equal to minus and here the constant will be uh, like it is a constant so it will come out so can i write like this constant and what left that will be delta v upon v gamma is left over there and it problem in this okay so now if i will shift up like a shift this v gamma in that case so what it will be is equal to this constant we can assume any constant like suppose k maan lete yes so this will be and this is don't forget to v i and v final so can i write this is 1 okay it is 1 uh, gamma is 1 so upar jayega to can i write v is equal to uh, like uh, gamma minus 1 yes so this will be uh, constant and here it will be delta v and this will be v gamma minus 1 okay this thing so now if initial and this is final and if again we will do work is equal to minus k constant it is and then it will be uh, instead of this one time uh, v uh, for v we will write v final and another time we will write v initial okay so let me write this okay so this will uh, can i write like this is mine if it is gamma over here so it will be minus gamma isn't it is there any problem in this okay so now integrate it so we are going to integrate integrate it so this is it will be like this is constant k minus k will come out yes and this is v uh, v ka power or like x ka power m or n we can say so what it is that integration when we do this is x uh, ka power n plus 1 and upon n plus 1 this is the integration you might be studied in class uh, in maths yes so this is we can write in this way like this we can write v minus gamma plus 1 upon gamma plus 1 can i write this will be yes x uh, power n so that will be x power n plus 1 and upon n plus 1 yes and this will be v final and v initial so what we will do we will keep it uh, like one time it will be v final one time it will be vi we will keep in place of v so can i write like this mm -hmm. so w is uh, sorry w is equal to minus k and in a state of this uh, this is let me write over here v final and then v final minus gamma uh, plus 1 can we can i write yes minus v initial this is and the gamma, let me take it out as this minus gamma plus 1 okay i will uh, explain how to do, what to do next and this is it will be minus gamma plus 1 can i write like this so now take out the minus common So, and minus minus will be cancelled out so what it will be left with it will be left with k upon gamma plus uh, sorry 1 minus gamma can we write yes let me write this 1 minus gamma i will write it here and this is like v final gamma plus 1 or so in this in this let me bifurcate this power 
so we know that if the base are same then the power uh, will be add on isn't it so can i write in instead of all this can i write that v final minus gamma into v final mm -hmm. yes yeah so this is one it will be add on and it will give this similarly this v initial minus gamma into v initial yes can i write like this so now let me write 1 minus gamma sorry gamma minus 1 of gamma minus 1 yes let me write okay so now what we will do now this uh now i have to like let me take this k inside okay so what it will be it will be k v final minus gamma into v final yes minus k v initial minus gamma into v initial upon what gamma minus 1 can i write like this okay so just look at here i have told you that this is pv is equal to nrt isn't it or in this case like this one is if these two are same that means this is equal to this means we can write here p1 v1 gamma is equal to constant and p2 v2 gamma is constant can i write like this then if r, r just equal same uh, lss will be equal then only it came so this constant is suppose k so instead of k can i put the value like this yes so with the v final with the v final i will keep with this uh, v uh, v final I, I will take isn't it so let me take this is okay so here w will be equal to instead of this k i will write this final one so this is p final and then v final instead of this k i have written gamma yes now v final v final minus gamma into v final yes can i write like this now minus instead of this k i will write p1 p initial wala so p initial v initial instead of this k i have written yes now v initial power gamma minus gamma so v initial minus this into v initial got it upon upon gamma minus 1 got it so now you can check this this is v final gamma power gamma and this is v uh, final minus gamma so this will be cancelled out isn't it similarly this will be cancelled out so what left this is left with w is equal to p final v final minus p initial v initial upon gamma minus 1 yes so instead of this now again think of it can i write like this yes nrt and obviously uh, this temperature won't be changed why because it is adia but uh, the temperature will be different because uh, this is not uh, isothermal yes so if it is isothermal to wahan pe constant temperature hota but it is not uh, isothermal so obviously the temperature will change so can i write like instead of this nr t final minus nr t initial upon gamma minus 1 so what we can do we can write nr take it as a common this will be t final minus t initial upon gamma minus 1 so this uh, uh, work done work done is not uh, like work done in adiabatic expansion ad, uh, reversible adiabatic expansion okay this is not in your ncrt so you don't worry about that you don't have to do this uh, derivation and all that okay just uh, uh, maybe in the mcq in of the entrance and all and uh, there will be numerical there can be numerical and in, in CQ they can ask the formula and about all these things so that's why it was necessary to explain okay dear next thing we will start in next class so by the time thank you class